hey guys so welcome back i hope you enjoyed the first part of this video if you haven't seen it i will put it in the description box below guys if you're new to my channel hi i'm your plane and i'm one of the beauty influencer i do makeup videos product reviews and all that other jazz uh, this video if you are watching might be a second part and if you haven't seen the first part i'll link it somewhere here so you can go and watch it in this video we are going to cover how to do this beautiful beginner eye look even though you have no idea what you're doing you're totally new you don't know brushes blending whatever you can still create this beautiful eye look is so easy and uh yeah so without wasting any more time let's just get into this video however if you're new to my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so every time i'm posting a video you will get a notification uh yeah so let's just go into this video and create this beautiful eye look love you all take care Bye. <laughs> Hey my angels, so it took me a very long time to post the part 2 which is apologies but here we go. For part 2 we are starting with the um, eyes and I'm going to start with my brows. For brows I'm using Urban Decay Brow Blade in shade Dark Brown and also Benefit um, Brow Powder and this kit is in shade 5. To prime my eyes I use P. Louise um, eye primer in shade rumor 02 and I'm picking up the shade dark brown shade from uh, one size eyeshadow palette and I'm going to apply this on the outer part of my eye the idea is to just pack the shade first and then go with the clean blending brush and just smooth out the harsh edges it's very very easy it's very simple to do if you just take your time and do it slowly it's gonna work out perfectly well and then you can take a very fluffy and big blending brush and just create like a cat eye effect by blending it out outer part of the eye um, now I'm taking Kaja uh, trio eyeshadow and this one is in number 02 which is orange blossom and I picked up the sh uh, one of the champagne shades and I applied that on the lid um, I'm also going to just make my outer be a little bit more intense by adding a terracotta shade from the one size beauty again and now I'm picking up this really nice dark brown shade and I'm going to create a fake wing creating a wing with the eyeshadow is so easy and is so like perfect to do because if you make any mistakes it's only eyeshadow you can blend it and start again um if you are not comfortable doing that you can stop at by adding the champagne shade and that's about it but if you are okay then go for it i'm following the same steps what i applied on my eye on my lower lash line and i'm just adding a huda beauty eye pencil on my upper lash line so when i apply my lashes it looks more natural for my inner corner i'm using charlotte tilbury um, film film star bronze and highlight palette for my mascara i'm using ila beauty mascara and for lashes i'm actually using my own brand i'm pretty girl lashes uh, along with our own glue and i'm uh, taking the style i'm pretty and i'm going to apply this on my eyes this particular lash style is very very natural it's very wispy but it's not really full-on kind of thing it gives you a very nice natural looking eye eyelashes without looking overboard hope you guys enjoyed the second part i'll see you guys soon love you all take care stay safe <laughs> 